Director Clemens Sienknecht has turned his attention to Effie Briest, but he's given this piece of classic German literature by Theodor Fontana a new light-handed touch, turning it into a wacky musical review. Key scenes from the 19th century realist novel are recreated in a radio station from the 1970s. The play is fun and enjoyable, proving that high-quality productions don't have to contain hard-hitting political commentary to be included in the Theatertreffen. The other Hamburg production is more overtly political and perhaps a bit less accessible. An adaptation of Federico Fellini's film And the Ship Sails On, it confronts passengers on board a luxury liner with refugees who've been rescued by the captain. But here, refugees are no victims. They challenge the other passengers and the audience as well. Despite that, the production has been a huge success. Its director, Karin Bayer, who is also artistic director of the Schauspielhaus Hamburg, says it's typical of the risks her company takes. It's a balancing act. We put on plays that are less well known but are important to us and take the risk that only a few hundred people will come. That's why we have other plays in our program that we also think are interesting but are perhaps a bit easier for the audience, so then we'll get a full house. It doesn't usually work out that way, though. I do have to say that. But here, the risk has paid off, helping to make the Schauspielhaus one of the highlights at this year's Theatertreffen.